Kentucky. So October National Arts and Humanities Month and to celebrate the Abilene Public Library wants to display your art at the South Branch. So here to tell us more on how you can take part is our dear friend, Tony Redmond. Welcome, glad to have you here, sir. Thanks, Good Joni. Good to see you. Good to see you again. Uh, art, we can, every, everyone has an artistic side. I think it's just a matter of tapping into what kind and what aesthetic best suits every individual. That's true. It's just, a, like I said, a matter of kind of bringing it out and finding a good way to do it. And hopefully this is a good way for people they're, you know, amateur artists and maybe a little bit better to come by and show some art that we and show at the library. And it's not, it's not overwhelming or intimidating. I love mm -mm. that because we're starting, I mean, it's, it's, um, it's, it's a, a little, tiny little display of art, but you can make a big impact with even a tiny little mm -hmm. spaces. Look this, at this. That little bit, that little tiny this, like guy right there. two inches, two and a half inches. It is, uh, three yeah. by three, according to my three notes. Three by three. Okay, <laughs> well, that's so much for me. That's three, <laughs> three by three. Mm -hmm. And what do they do with this art? So this is coming up that anyone can partake in. And in mm -hmm. fact, you all are supplying all the necessary pieces. And, yeah. and um, this will be at the South Branch and uh, it'll be for the month of September. Uh, these are some samples of what we've had previously. And uh, they'll uh, register in person to pick up an art kit, which will include a canvas and some paints and a brush. And you don't have to use these paints if you have something else you want to use. That's perfectly fine. You're not fine. limited. You are not limited. Okay. And in fact, we, we like people to be as unlimited as possible within reason. Sure. Uh, <laughs> but um, you can come by the South Branch, the one at the mall, and uh, like I said, register for it. It'll be during the month of September. And they'll pick up their art kit and uh, turn it in before October 1st, and then they'll display them at the South Branch all October long for uh, National Arts and Humanities Month. I love this. Th now, you've done this several years. We've, we've had people on. These are probably, again, some examples of what they've done uh, last year or so. Mm -hmm. And some of these are, you know, a little more abstract, and mm -hmm. some are a little more intricate. I mean, this one's, you've got shading on this ladybug over here, so yeah. I mean, just depending. That's next but level. I mean, I guess if you wanted to do something like charcoal, if you wanted to do something mm -hmm. in oils, if you mm -hmm. happen to have those different mediums, you could certainly partake and, and do that as well. Mm -hmm. um, you do or, crayons if you want to. Oh, see, there's a, don't get, that's our next segment. We'll get to the crayons. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Jumping in, sorry. <laughs> I, I, we may get, get Catalina to, to join in in her own artistic endeavor. That with sounds this good. As well. But this is something everyone gets to do, and it's free. It is 100% free. Yeah. Um, like I said, they, this. Like I said, they just need to sign up uh, for uh, the registration. I, I don't know if that'll be probably on the website. Sure. If not, you can call the South Branch or and they swing can by and, and find out when it is and uh, they'll nobody be happy there. to tell you. Great things to see at the South Branch at all the branches of the library, but these will actually be on this on the display down there when they're it's all. You've had pretty good turnouts in years past, haven't you? We have. We have. Uh, it's like I said, it's something that's fun. It's that all ages can do uh, all abilities, uh, just some, you know, and I've seen some of the other ones. They've been all different subjects, all sorts of things. All right, so you've got about a month to get, get you registered, to get, pick up your supplies, and to get it over back to the library. So you have a month to work on your masterpiece in mm -hmm. whatever medium you prefer. And that's and, uh, Three inches by three inches, and then it'll be on display. And uh, I guess as far as the winner, that's kind of a, a subjective as to your aesthetic and what your personal preference is. Yep, yep. If you got Everybody's it done, a you're a winner. <laughs> I think so, too. <laughs> Everyone sees art a little differently. I love that you all do this project, and I love that everyone can get involved. Make it a whole family affair, if you'd like, and everyone Definitely, can yeah. do their own artistic. You see more and more of that. So mm -hmm. we would love for you to take part. Tony, thank you so much. Thank um, you, Joni. Can't wait to see what art comes about in October at the Public Library yes. at the South Branch. Yes, ma'am. If you. you would like to take part in the mini art exhibit, you can certainly pick up those kits this September. That starts, you know, uh, this weekend, so starting on Monday at the South Branch Library in the Mall of Abilene. Well, not Monday. That's Labor Day, but you, mm. you get the idea. <laughs> then all you have to do is turn in your finished piece by October. October the 1st. For more information, simply call the number 698-7565 or go online to abilenetx.gov slash APL.